this is Kevin Nelson known as AWOL. And today we're working on a bracelet that came from a photo. It is what our 23rd bracelet that I made from a photo. Sorry, I have it written down and it's rather way, way. This thing is essentially a very small arrowhead. The uh, where it goes three one three one three one um and then towards middle it changes from being just a regular arrowhead to a zigzag at, that's mirrored and makes it go into an x and a lot of people were like "Ooh, that's interesting and i uh, i wanted to see how difficult this thing was to make and overall i would say yes this is not for the faint of heart this is not the worst. I mean, this is this is intermediate. This is not like, you know, become a pro and then you can do it. I think this is just difficult and tedious and you don't get big areas, swatches to work on. So it takes a while and there's a lot of checking the pattern. And I, I really did try to see if I could find like clever ways of doing better segmenting and things like that and find ways to kind of get ahead with it. And, I, and you'll see that there's some effort that kind of seems like it's working better than others. But um, yeah, kind of, kind of very time consuming. Now, it turns out really cool. And um, like I shared it with a friend of mine and immediately the reply came back like, uh, I can't remember what that guy's name is. One of the X-Men, the one with the, the laser vision thing, whatever, that was the reply that came back. And I had to admit, like, yeah, I see it. The colors that are chosen, um, really trying to just light it up and make the X become the most noticeable thing. Like all the dark colors moving inwards to the brightest color. And then inside of that is the stark contrast of the black against that yellow really makes it pop um so yeah the, the the colors are different from how i originally saw the picture or whatever i kind of went with something a little bit more dramatic kind of like fire and um yeah i like how it turned out um i can't remember how much faster i sped this thing up but i sped it up a lot because there's not a whole lot I can really tell you about this other than, you know, a little practice will help. Uh, I should have worked closer to the clip for the most part. It would have probably, the edges aren't bad, right? The edges aren't bad, but maybe it could have had a little bit more concentration on making it better if I kept it closer to the clip. Um, obviously, I don't do that because I want you guys to be able to see kind of how I'm working up through the pattern. I'm trying to do segments at the time to get it done. Um, I can't say that it was necessarily easier once you got past the middle point. In some ways, maybe a little bit, but not really. Um, and there was no color that was used so much that I was worried about making my tassels. So that's. I said there's it's just a a bracelet that worked out pretty cool and that um, maybe you guys will enjoy making for yourself um i suspect there could be a fun series of alterations to this like if you make it double wide you have two x's you know so you make it three you have triple x which yeah that would be Kind of funny to be wearing around. Uh, it would get attention. Um, tell them it's for the, the the movie that you really like the Vin Diesel. Don't tell them it's you know, uh, yeah. Um, yeah. I don't know what else to tell you guys. If you guys like this kind of videos, like me making stuff in general, if you're still here, um, you can help support the channel by becoming a YouTube member. Um, there's Patreon as well, but 
I'm really going to try to explain why I think the YouTube member is better. You can see all these videos way in advance because like this one won't be out for almost um, three weeks, two and a half weeks, um, maybe more. But yeah, it's, um, no, it might be almost a month. Anyways, way in advance, you get to see the videos. Um, you get to have access to telling me what to make and stuff like that. Like I, I post, um, uh, what do you call that? Where you vote for stuff? Anyways, yeah, you get to vote for stuff, try to make things happen. Stuff like that, a lot of things in advance. So, um, yeah, well, join up and stuff, or become a Patreon member. Patreon member probably pays me the most, like as far as like the split for the commission, but it's just a lot harder for me to make content for them. And uh, if you really just want to see stuff early, including like the the ornaments that won't be out till November. But now that's over there for the YouTube members. So, yeah, it would be really awesome if you guys would join. Um, kind of, it motivates me as well as it's, uh, it helps to find the strength and uh, some of the other stuff. I, I want to try to build a better production. I, there's like a shadow over here. I want better lighting, little things that I want that all cost money. And, um, a little bit of help would go a long way. So, thank you. Um, you, know, you can see the X's. Finally, we got the front half of it done. Going through with the other side. It was. It was fun. It, it's it's an interesting bracelet. I, I who knows to whoever came up with the original pattern. Um, but that's the, one of the things around here, like. I can appreciate somebody making a pattern going to the trouble. Uh, and then somebody like me can come along and you learn how the strings go or what the pattern, what the thing looks like, putting it into a graph paper, you can make the pattern yourself once you have that. Because I don't think I could have made this without having done the pattern first. It's just, I don't know looking at it and just kind of winging it would have been a lot harder. So, you know, me teaching you how to make the pattern means that anything that even if it's stuff that I've made, you know, the most complicated thing I could ever think of, you will be able to go through, grab some of the graph paper, be able to use that to figure out how many strings are involved, and then use one of the templates and fill it in for yourself. And you would have, you know, your version of what I made. You know, I, I get it. I, for a long time, when, when certain artists were like, you can't share my pattern. What, what are you talking about? Like anybody can break down any pattern if they have enough time and patience and know how, and I have all those things. So if anybody ever told me that I'm not allowed to copy, I'm a, sure to immediately go and copy it. That's just, yeah. And that's not me being me. That's just me knowing that this craft is not so complicated that you can't just do it. It's just not, it's just not. There's only four knots involved. One to the right, one to the left, one to the right that then goes to the left, and one to the left that then goes to the right. That's it, it's just those four make up everything that we put together here. Unless you're doing alphas and those just feel like cheating. So I really don't do those. Um, we're getting towards the end. I have no idea what else I'm going to be doing here today, but I really hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you guys are enjoying this. If you haven't already, take a look at how I made the pattern. That's the video that came just before this one. Um, I think it's interesting how breaking down a pattern can be. And um, yeah, like I said, once you kind of get the hang of how to do that, 
pretty much anything that you see, whether on Instagram or wherever, you can make. And you can then even try to put your own spin on it, change it up a bit. This one has, what, uh, black, red, other red, you know, four colors. What, why not try to make it with five, you know? Make, extend it out a little bit longer, make the X a little bit bigger, make the, the fade a little bit more interesting, you know? Because, like I said, once you learn how to make the patterns, do anything you want. A lot of fun stuff that, you know, however you feel like it. And that's what I want to teach you guys is that uh, patterns aren't just for the few to make. You can all do it. So, and we're getting really close to the end. Since we're the, and I'm like we're working so far away from it. It really is full pattern though. I really do think this will turn out. So, all right guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Thank you for just being here. If you could just hit the like button, that would be awesome. And uh, yeah, here comes the big reveal. Almost there. Yeah, a little bit more. There you go. All right, as always, don't get your strings in a bunch.